Hi there, my name is Chris, sales manager for Sound and Vision in Bolton. You've chosen to look at today the Panasonic SC BTT 370 Home Theatre System. This particular unit is a 3D Blu-ray Home Theatre unit comprising of five satellite speakers, two for the front, two for the rear, centre speaker and a subwoofer. The satellite speakers are 160 watts per channel, so that's five times 160 watts, and 200 watts from the subwoofer itself. The sub is a downward firing uh, subwoofer, so the speakers are located at the bottom of the sub here, firing down towards the floor, so the actual um, bass radiates out very well into the room itself. Now this home theatre system uh, is very straightforward first of all to wire up. All the sockets on the back are colour coded for the speakers so you just uh, connect the, uh, the red uh, cable from the front speaker to the red terminal and so forth. Very very straightforward to do. When you switch the unit on the menu system is also very straightforward and easy to work through on the system itself. The unit itself, as I said, is 160 watts per channel, 200 watts on the sub, so 1000 watts total output, and it plays your 3D Blu-ray DVDs as well as uh, Blu-ray DVDs, standard DVDs and CDs as well. There's also an FM AM tuner built into this unit, and you've also got an iPod dock on the front of it where you can put your iPod or your iPhone on there as well. Underneath the flap here, you've also got an SD card, re SD card reader and a uh, USB slot as well. And it will read things like DivX, DivX HD, MKV files, MP3, JPEG and MPO files as well. So the menu is up on screen at the moment. The unit comes with a remote control. On the remote itself you've got up, down, right, left and OK in the centre. Those are the controls that you're going to be using more than any other. And it will work your way through this particular menu. So as we go through there, you've got, at the moment it's highlighted with the yellow around video. So if we press OK, which is the centre button here, it will take us into basically how you want to view your videos. You may have an SD card in here or USB. You would just, if it's a SD card reader, highlight SD, press OK, and you'll be watching uh, your photos through um, the SD card reader. Uh, if we come out of there, you've got other options for iPod settings, you've got sound adjustments on there as well. So you've got four adjustments on here for clear, soft, flat and heavy and you can adjust accordingly for how you want the sound to be coming out of here. Whether if you want more bass, you'd have it on heavy. If you want it pretty neutral, you'd have it on flat. If we come out of that particular menu, we'll move up from there to, uh, say, network. This particular unit has also got Wi-Fi uh, built into it, so you can access uh, various internet services through this unit. So we'll ask it to find some internet content uh, for us now. It will display the information on screen. You've got things like Skype on this unit as well, so if you get a Skype camera from us and plug it into your uh, Panasonic TV, you can make Skype to Skype phone calls through this unit. Those calls are free as well anywhere in the world. You've got things like age tracks to view latest movie clips, YouTube, and yet again, in the center here, it's highlighted in blue. We can move over to things like YouTube, press OK, and we'll be onto the YouTube site. We can click down then to say most viewed videos. Select <coughs> what you want from YouTube. It will display it in the box here, but you can also expand it out to full screen as well. You've got more pages as well within this internet menu so if you come back over to the center and down to more and yet again it will display more pages of information so we've got cinema trailers here so you can view what's on at the cinema at this particular time you've got things like um, latest weather information picasso so various options uh, on there as well if we just come out of that uh, menu now for you Okay, we'll come back to the other menu on there. So as I said, you've got other options in here as well. If we come down to Others and move over there and select that particular menu, you've then got Setup Facilities where you can go into uh, the Sound menu, for instance, and set up your speakers. So if we come down to Speakers there, and it will give us different options on screen where you can adjust each level manually. So we can adjust the, uh, the right or the left front speaker or the rear speakers or the center speaker. And you would highlight, um, we've got on there um, either uh, the rear um, or the, uh, the front centers, whichever speaker you want to adjust, just highlight it accordingly on screen. So if you want to adjust that particular speaker there, just press OK 
and you can either raise or lower that particular volume level. And just press OK, you can move on then to a different speaker and your subwoofer here as well so you can turn the volume up from the sub or down. So you can adjust each level accordingly to however you want it. That's your centre speaker, so yet again you can adjust accordingly. So nice and easy to use and all you're using on there is up, down, right and left and adjusting accordingly on screen. So nice and easy to set up. This particular unit is on demonstration in both our Bolton and Leeds stores. What I would say is calling for demonstration, it sounds absolutely stunningly good. You've got two HDMI sockets on the back of this unit, two inputs, so you can feed something like your uh, satellite or cable box into here as well as a game, games console. So you can have just one cable from the unit to the TV itself and everything is playing through the unit um, and very straightforward to set up. Calling to our stores for demonstration this unit, as I said, I'll go through to our website, which is sonyinvision.co.uk. There are hundreds of video clips on there, not just on home theatre systems, but on amplifiers, speakers, and the latest LCD, LED, and plasma TVs as well. Or give me a call. My name is Chris on 01204 861 861. Thank you.